somebody. My name is Bridget Shalou. I'm the organizer of the Miss West Africa UK, and we're working in partnership with West African Relief Charity and the Phoenix Resource Centre. It's a real pleasure today to have you here to embark on this new project that we have together with uh, Afiba Media and with uh, Miss West Africa International, uh, UK as well. And basically the idea behind this is to turn all of this cloth that's been kindly given to us by the Phoenix Resource Centre and to turn it into saleable items of fashion design garments. And the most important part of that process is Bridget's input into this, whereby through her contacts, all of her hard work over these years, she can allow us to turn this cloth into saleable items which will raise funds for the projects that we have. The money that is generated from the sale of the final garments, which we hope will be very high quality and very unique, will then go towards making smaller cooperative units in Africa whereby women can make clothes the same as are being made here in the UK and uh, generate an income from that. It's very good to help people and give away some of the items we've got but it's essential that people are able to feed themselves and look after themselves. It gives them dignity and allows them to have the freedom to make their own choices in life. Employment. Without a job you literally cannot live. Without a job you can't send your children to school. Without a job in somewhere like West Africa, your kids can be sick and you can't do anything about it because here there's no free there's no free medicine, there's no free health care. You have to have a job to pay for the basic things in your life. So the West West African West African relief is tackling the issue of employment. They're creating jobs. We are creating jobs for people. I mean, you can come down here and give somebody $10 every day and they can feed themselves, whatever. But you've not given them anything tangible. You've not given them something that could, that could look after their family for the rest of their life. From a donor's point of view, it's impossible to keep giving and giving and giving. It's unsustainable. So what we need to achieve here with this project is a, a, a system whereby we can facilitate people making something that's useful, something that's worthwhile doing, and through that process, generate an income for themselves and make it self-sustainable, so that once the initial investments have been made for each individual project in Africa, that then there's no need for further donations or support from the public, because basically it will be West Africans helping themselves. Thank you, Jell. Um, you so um, you've heard from Jell. Ultimately, as he rightly said, there's so much money you can give. So initially, if we're able to empower these people in West Africa to create sustainable revenue for themselves, that is the objective of the Phoenix and Resource Center, and also, most importantly, the West African Relief. So we're urging everyone who sees vi this video to get involved with us at www.westafricanrelief.com and um, the Phoenix Resource Centre. Centre. You can contact them through us at our website, which is info at westafricanrelief.com. One of the main objects of this project is that um, uh, Bridget Chalou, who's um, the owner of the West, uh, Miss West Africa UK franchise, has assembled a number of um, top designers who have African origins, and those people have freely given their time to design a new range of clothes from which this material is going to be turned into saleable items. We also have far superior cloth that's coming down from our other warehouse in Northampton, and from that higher quality cloth, we will then make high-end designer clothes. So if anybody's watching and they are going to the Oscars this year, then perhaps you might want to wear one of our <laughs> nice dresses that these girls are going to participate and help with design. Hi, my name is Olivia Balou. I'm representing Ivory Coast in West Africa, UK 2012.
My name is Mercy Avil Korayem. I'm representing Nigeria in this West Africa UK 2012. Thank you. Hey guys, my name is Sarah Okereke. I'm 18 years old. I'll be representing Nigeria in Miss West Africa UK. Hi, my name is Catherine Akam and I'm representing Ghana in Miss West Africa UK 2012. Hello, my name is Adam Bari. I'm representing Guinea-Bissau in Miss West Africa UK 2012. Excellent. Hello everyone, I'm Esther Bressard Oyeru. I'm representing the Ivory Coast in Miss West Africa UK 2012. Thank you. Hi, my name is Samita Greywood. I'm representing Sierra Leone in Miss West Africa UK 2012. My name is Tadisha Sego and I'm representing Ghana for Miss West Africa UK 2012. First of all, I'd just like to thank all of the girls coming today and Bridget, who's the uh, owner of the franchise of Miss West Africa UK. Uh, the girls have come along today and given their free time to help us with the charity, which is West African Relief. Uh, we feel very blessed to have them to, here today. As you can see, that they've already been working very hard and separating material that we've got to send down to Africa. given up their time freely and so has Bridget who's hiding in the background there but she's done a tremendous job to get us all here today and um, I'd just like everybody to know who watches this that um, whilst Miss West Africa UK is a franchise and obviously it's a very important project they've given up their time freely and they're doing a tremendous piece of charity work which is not only helping us as a charity here uh, for West African Relief, but it's also making a big difference to the ladies down in West Africa. So thank you very much for being here today, and well done, girls. Empathy, understanding, action. West African Relief, Miss West Africa, UK.